Here are 30 most commonly asked vendor master data related interview questions. With detailed and informative answers for SAP MM materials management interviews. 1. What is vendor master data in SAP MM? Answer. Vendor master data is a central repository in SAP MM that contains information about suppliers or vendors. It includes details such as vendor name, address, communication data, payment terms, and purchasing related information. 2. What are the key views in the vendor master data record? Answer. The key views in vendor master data include general data, company code data, purchasing organization data, and accounting data. These views store information related to the vendor's general information, financial details, and purchasing interactions. 3. Explain the general data view in vendor master data. Answer. The general data view includes basic information about the vendor, such as name, address, communication details, and tax-related information. It is crucial for identifying and contacting the vendor. 4. What is the significance of the company code data view in vendor master data? Answer. The company code data view in vendor master data contains information relevant to financial transactions with the vendor, such as payment terms, reconciliation, account, and currency settings specific to the company code. 5. Explain the purchasing organization data view in vendor master data. Answer. The purchasing organization data view includes details related to purchasing interactions with the vendor, such as payment terms, delivery tolerances, and specific purchasing organization-related settings. 6. How does vendor master data integrate with other SAP modules such as FI and MM? Answer, vendor master data integrates with other SAP modules. By providing information essential for financial transactions FI and procurement processes MM, the views in vendor master data are linked to corresponding modules to ensure seamless information flow. 7. What is the purpose of the account group in vendor master data? Answer, the account group in vendor master data determines the number range, field status, and other settings for vendor accounts. It helps in categorizing vendors based on similar characteristics or attributes. 8. Explain the concept of the vendor account group in vendor master data. Answer. The vendor account group is a key grouping criterion for vendors with similar characteristics. It is assigned during the creation of the vendor master record and influences the structure of the vendor account. 9. How do you create a new vendor master data record in SAP? MM? Answer. To create a new vendor master data record, use the transaction code MK01 Create Vendor or XK01 for centrally creating a vendor. Enter the required data, including general details, purchasing information, and accounting information, and save the record. 10. Explain the purpose of the payment terms in vendor master data. Answer. Payment terms in vendor master data specify the conditions under which payment should be made to the vendor. It includes details such as the due date, discount percentages, and payment methods. 11. What are the key fields in the general data view of vendor master data? Answer. Key fields in the general data view include vendor name, address, country, postal code, city, and communication details, such as telephone and email. These fields are essential for identifying and contacting the vendor. 12. How do you extend vendor master data to different company codes? Answer. Vendor master data can be extended to different company codes. Using the transaction code XK01 create vendor or XK02 change vendor. During the creation or modification, you can enter data specific to each company code. 13. Explain the concept of the remittance advice in vendor master data. Answer. The remittance advice in vendor master data provides information to the vendor on how payments are made, including details such as the bank and account information. It serves as a communication tool for payment-related information. 14. How is withholding tax information maintained in vendor master data? Answer. 
withholding tax information is maintained in the accounting data view of vendor master data. It includes details such as withholding tax codes, tax identification numbers, and tax categories applicable to the vendor. 15. Explain the role of the partner functions in vendor master data. Answer. Partner functions in vendor master data specify the roles of different parties involved in the business relationship. Examples include the ordering party, contact person, and payee. These functions help in defining communication and interaction with the vendor. 16. What is the purpose of the unloading point in vendor master data? Answer. The unloading point in vendor master data specifies the location where goods are unloaded upon receipt from the vendor. It is important for logistics and inventory management. 17. How does vendor master data support the procure to pay P2P process in SAP? MM? Answer. Vendor master data supports the procure to pay process by providing essential information for creating purchase requisitions purchase orders, and goods receipts. It includes details such as vendor name, payment terms, and purchasing organization data. 18. Explain the concept of the sort key in vendor master data. Answer. The sort key in vendor master data is used for sorting and categorizing line items in accounting documents. It helps in organizing financial transactions for reporting and analysis purposes. 19. What is the significance of the tax number 1 and tax number to fields in vendor master data? Answer. Tax number 1 and tax number 2 fields in vendor master data. Store tax identification numbers or registration numbers relevant to tax authorities. These fields are essential for legal and regulatory compliance. 20. Explain the purpose of the terms of payment in vendor master data. Answer. Terms of payment in vendor master data define the conditions under which payment is made to the vendor. It includes details such as the payment due date, cash discount percentages, and payment methods. 21. What is the role of the data retention segment in vendor master data? Answer. The data retention segment in vendor master data defines the retention period for archived data. It is used for managing data storage and archiving policies in compliance with legal and regulatory requirements. 22. How do you handle changes to existing vendor master data in SAP? MM? Answer. To change existing vendor master data, use the transaction code MKO2 change vendor. Enter the vendor number, make the necessary modifications in the relevant views, and save the changes. 23. Explain the purpose of the account assignment group in vendor master data. Answer. The account assignment group in vendor master data is used for determining the type of account assignment for the vendor. It influences how financial transactions are posted in the accounting system. 24. What is the significance of the alternative payer field in vendor master data? Answer. The alternative payer field in vendor master data allows specifying a different entity or account to be used for payment purposes. It is useful in situations where payments may be made by a party other than the primary vendor. 25. How does vendor master data support the order to cash out to C process in SAP? MM? Answer. Vendor master data supports the order to cash process by providing information for purchase orders, goods, receipts, and invoicing. It includes details such as payment terms, purchasing organization data, and accounting information. 26. Explain the concept of the IBAN International Bank account number in vendor master data. Answer. The IBAN in Vendor Master Data stores the international bank account number for electronic funds transfers. It is crucial for accurate and efficient payment processing across international borders. 27. What is the purpose of the industry key in Vendor Master Data? Answer. The industry key in Vendor Master Data defines the industry-specific attributes and settings for a vendor. It influences how the vendor is processed and managed providing industry-specific functionality and behavior. 28. How do you handle mass changes to vendor master data in SAP? MM? Answer. 
mass changes to vendor master data can be performed using transaction code MKMAS or by using LUSM Legacy System Migration Workbench. LUSM allows for the creation or modification of multiple vendor master records in a structured manner. 29. Explain the concept of the address usage in vendor master data. Answer. Address usage in vendor master data allows specifying different addresses for various purposes such as correspondence, goods, receipt, and remittance. It provides flexibility in managing multiple addresses for a vendor. 30. What are the challenges in vendor master data maintenance, and how do you overcome them? Answer. Challenges in vendor master data maintenance include data accuracy, consistency, and timely updates. Overcoming these challenges requires implementing data governance policies, regular reviews, and providing training to users responsible for vendor data maintenance. These questions and answers cover various aspects of vendor master data in the context of SAP MM, providing a comprehensive understanding for interview preparation. Interviewers may tailor questions based on specific project requirements or the candidate's experience level. For more exciting tips, tricks and more importantly, for valuable insights of interviews, please share like and subscribe to my channel. It has a lot of valuable information about various insights of interviews. It has a wide range of real-world portfolio projects of various technologies for interviews, and it has wide range of most asked interview questions and answers of various technologies like data science, SAP, AWS, DevOps, and full-stack web development, and more. That will be useful during interviews. It has a wide range of most asked interview questions and answers and real-world portfolio projects of various technologies for freshers. For two to three years, experienced candidates, and for five or above years, experienced candidates to test their skills by knowing most asked interview questions and make themselves ready for interviews.